Hello, what's going on YouTube? It's your boy Austin Joey here. Um, I'm making another recording video. Uh, I want to talk about something that's very serious and has been um, eating me up lately um, for a whole year now. I know I look older. You haven't seen me in a long time. I don't really have a face cam or anything and for Street Fighter. Uh, but that's besides the point. Today, I want to talk about um, my best friend in all the wide world. His name is Josiah Combs. Capital J O S I A H. Capital C O M B S. No, no, no O. And um, the reason why I want to talk about him is because he's missing. Um, not, not you know, kidnapped or anything like that. But uh, he. I don't have his phone number. I didn't be able to contact him for a whole year. And we were all talking about one day uploading videos and stuff together on this channel called Austin Joey. We said that this was our channel. And I don't know why I named this channel Austin Joey. I should have named it Austin Joey and Josiah Combs. If there's any way I can uh, change the channel name, I'm going to do it. But I want to know where he is. He's not in any of my class rosters, um, and I, I, I don't know where he is. He didn't have a phone last time we met, which was somewhere in early April or March, and it's been almost a year now since I haven't talked to him. I couldn't get his phone number. He didn't have a phone number. He didn't have anything. He didn't have an iPad even or a or a laptop, um, and. Checking in my sophomore year in high school, um, in any of my classes, I couldn't find him. So, I have one picture of the man, because he used to record um, some skits before the pandemic hit. And that's the main reason why I don't know where he is. If anyone knows where he is, please contact me under the YouTube comments or through Instagram um, my Instagram name is, uh, lowercase, all lowercase letters, the underscore next underscore Casey. Don't ask. Um, that's a long story. Um, but you could reply there if you want to either. I have, I have already made a post of my one picture I had of him. It's a really nice picture. You can tell, you can see what it looks like and everything just so you can make sure you know. If anyone that knows him, they can make sure that they know. Yeah, that's what he actually looked like. And, um, I don't know where he is. I have no idea. I didn't even know where he lived. Like, I didn't know any information about him. Um, he just didn't look like he was comfortable, you know, giving out the information. So, even though we both trust each other to the full of everything, and, you know, we loved each other to death, you know, I didn't really, we didn't tell each other about the, our addresses and, you know, we're so young that we can't we can't drive over there, you know. So I got some information from a person on Instagram that he used to live in this um apartment complex and I didn't know where he lived, so that was new information for me. Big shout out to that guy. I don't know his name, something anonymous. Like, yeah. Um, I might shout him out on Instagram, but, uh, he definitely helped me out with that. I didn't know, or she, um, helped me out with that. Thank you very much. Um, that's the starting place to look for him. But if anyone knows where he is, please tell me. His name is Josiah Combs. Um, he's about, by now, he's probably just as tall as me, honestly. I mean, 5'9", five, 5'10". Five, um, he's black. He doesn't... I don't know what he looks like. It's been a year since I saw him, um, but he used to have uh, the picture says it all on Instagram. He had a flat top. Didn't really have any facial hair. Um, he's a really nice guy, um, and he's just uh, just a great person to be around. That's definitely my best friend in the whole wide world. I'd do anything for him. He'd do anything for me. We had each other's backs in school, and um, yeah, um, he I, apparently he couldn't afford a phone. And that's why we can never talk. I can never get his phone number, you know. And um, man, I just took advantage 
of, of always having a guarantee to talk to him every single day. I definitely regret that because I never, I, it was my fault. I never was like, oh, well, maybe what's your mom's phone number? Or, you know, whenever you go home, then I can call your mom. You're like, hey, can I speak to Josiah Combs? You know, I, I could have done that. You know, I'm like, well, do you have a school email? You know, I contact you through school email. You know, hey, where do you live? Maybe we could stop by or maybe you could stop by. Who knows? But nope, nope, nope. Never did any of that. Guys, <laughs> stupid kids, they will be stupid. But yeah, if anyone knows where he is, knows how to contact him, knows what school he lives in or um, he goes to, you know, know what new place. He probably doesn't live in that apartment complex because I don't know where he is in any of my rosters uh, for class, um, which that doesn't mean anything. But then again, he's terrible at math, and I was put in a beginning math class. Don't know why I was put in a beginning math class, but I was. I'm very angry about that, but that's besides the point. Uh, I was put in honors history class. He might not be in there. Um, but I was put in a really good ELA class, and he could have been in there. I was. I have a biology class that, you know, he could be in. You know, cause he. I don't think he took biology last year. Um, and I don't take ROTC, and I take band like basically over that to make up for that. So he should have been in at least one of my classes. I can't see him anywhere in the rosters. So I tried contacting the counselor, and you know how counselors are. I can't give out personal information about students, you know. So um, I don't know where he is. <laughs> I don't know where he is. I'm pretty sure he doesn't go to Howard. So that means that he probably doesn't live in that same apartment complex. So if anyone knows where he is, please tell me. I am freaking out, man. I just can't live like this no more. I need to know where he is. I just want to make sure he's okay. That's the really all I really need. I don't need to see you. I just need to make sure you're okay. There's probably no way I can see him because he probably still don't have a phone yet. Come on, y'all. He needs to get a phone. Come on, man. Anyways. um, But yeah, anyone can... Um, you can just comment down below or on my Instagram. Um, I tried making comments, you know. I just decided to make this video because I tried putting the same comment under every single last one of my videos. Even the Street Fighter ones. All of them. But usually they just didn't go in. They just disappeared. I don't know why. I refreshed after posting it and then it was gone. So, um... I just decided to make this whole video and post it. See what you think about that now. Like, I'm going to have people find out that I'm looking for this man. I have searched all over Howard um, website, campus, rosters and stuff. I ain't, I ain't been able to find a roster. But I've searched all over their websites. I ain't found them. Um, I did find out the little tidbit of information where he possibly could still be living in um, this apartment complex. I won't say where. Um, but, um, yeah, uh, I am going to check there one day. I can't go there right now. I, I'm too young to drive. So, yeah. And I just hope he's okay. I don't see anything else. Um, oh, uh, the more people that view this video, the bigger chance that, he, I could get some information about him. So, please share this video with everyone you know. I don't really care about the views. I I just want to know where he is. I want to make sure he's okay. And the more people that see this, that's why I posted on Instagram first because I have more followers. So, just please let let me know. Anybody share it with everyone, and hopefully. They should, you should find them. I don't want this video to be too long. Golly, it's pretty long already. Um, 10 minutes, man. Jeez. Um, he should be somewhere in Georgia. I'm not saying he might not be. I don't know. But he should be somewhere in Georgia. Um, at least. But he's probably not in Bibb County. Probably not in Howard, at least. But yeah, thank you guys very much um, for listening. And please tell me, anyone that knows anything about him, or where he might be, how he's doing. 
please contact me. Thank you guys very much. I don't know what I usually say at the end of my videos for an outro, but see you guys next time. Peace.